Well, it was a close shave for more than 240 people on board a Turkish airline aircraft that uh, skidded off the runway in Kathmandu earlier today. The aircraft from Istanbul had made a zero visibility landing in dense fog at the Tribhuvan International Airport. According to reports, the Airbus A330's front landing gear collapsed and the plane nosedived on the runway. Deputy Editor Shivaru now joins from the newsroom. Shiv, quite a miraculous escape for all those passengers today. Very, very close call for that A330, uh, Vedika. Uh, we understand that after a seven-hour flight uh, from Istanbul to Kathmandu, uh, this particular Turkish Airlines flight had actually circled around the Tribhuvan International Airport in Kathmandu at least a couple of times, uh, and there are actually pictures of that as well uh, circulating on Twitter and Facebook, uh, you know, suggesting that this was an aircraft uh, the, uh, where the crew was actually, uh, you know, quite nervous about, uh, uh, you know, final approach to that airport because of uh, a lot of rain, a lot of sleet and very low visibility uh, at that time in the morning. This was before 8 o'clock this morning uh, at that particular airport. Uh, finally, when uh, you know clearance was given to land and when the pilots uh, you know, uh, sort of had the confidence to actually bring the aircraft down, they overshot. But the most important part is, uh, uh, you know, as can be affirmed in these images, is uh, that the aircraft's nose wheel, uh, you know, the, the, uh, the, the part that comes down last, uh, actually collapsed. So the entire body of the aircraft tipped forward you know, scraped against the runway and came to a halt, uh, you know, well beyond the runway in a grassy patch. Uh, miraculous escape because yes. uh, there was no fire, uh, you know, nothing exploded. There were a lot of sparks, presumably, uh, you know, when the aircraft actually came down. Uh, but absolutely miraculous escape for over 200 people on board that plane. As you can see in these images, uh, you know, they, they have that evacuation slide. The aircraft, uh, you know, uh, the, uh, the, the aircraft is on the ground. Uh, no fire anywhere, no, no explosions of any kind. Uh, emergency services luckily had a chance to actually be on standby because the aircraft had circled twice uh, mm -hmm. you know over the airport before actually coming down so uh, you know I think we're absolutely right to call this an extremely close shave for those passengers as well as a nightmare for them Shiv also we're being told reports coming in that the front landing gear collapsed that's right. The, uh, the, the front wheels, which is uh, the, the nose wheel, yes. which is supposed to be the part that comes down last, that is the part that collapsed. So mm -hmm. remember, this may have, uh, uh, while investigations will obviously continue, and as you as you well know, Vedika, investigations into air accidents are extremely complicated. They go into you know all aspects of the mechanics of the aircraft, the circumstances of the landing, uh, you know what the condition of the runway was like. The fact that the nose wheel collapsed is extremely is extremely dis uh, disturbing and indicative of a possible mechanical failure because remember the entire undercarriage of the aircraft is built uh, you know to take extreme stresses of landing at high speed uh, so for an undercarriage or the nose wheel landing gear to actually collapse and go into the aircraft uh, is an unusual occurrence it's happened before but it's very unusual it shouldn't be happening now the reasons for why that happening was there uh, you know was there an extreme skidding situation was there a hydraulic or a mechanical failure with the aircraft itself was it a maintenance issue was it simply the fact that the, the you know there wasn't enough friction on the runway because of the sleet and the rain as a result of which the aircraft lost control and and that's why the landing gear went in all right. of those aspects will go uh, be gone into by the investigation that will happen right now very very close call for those passengers thanks for joining us Shiv. well that aircraft was on its way from istanbul to Kathmandu. more details in a while from now especially if there is a statement that comes out from the airline